Hi everyone, welcome to my Pink Sparkly channel. This is Pink Sparkly Cupcake Girl, and today I wanna to share with you what's in my EDC bag. And if you're not familiar with EDC, it stands for Everyday Carry. And you can find a wide range of EDC videos here on YouTube, all the way from the, you know, bare minimalistic bags, all the way up to like the extreme <laughs> survival. And mine's kinda of somewhere in between. And if you've been following my channel, you know, a couple of years ago, I shared my car tour video with you all, and I shared all the bags that I carry in the trunk of my car in separate videos. And um, I have redecorated the interior of my car, and it's completely finished, and I'm ready to upload the new video to share with you guys all the new pink sparkly decor that I have on the inside of my car. And I will be doing a series again this time and sharing each of my new bags in separate videos uh, you know sharing the contents of the bags with you all in separate videos so make sure to stay tuned for those so this is the first of the series this is my EDC bag that I carry in my car and uh, I just want to share this with you in case you know it gives you some ideas of the, some things you want to carry with you uh, you don't have to carry as much as I do I will go ahead and tell you right now that I am very extra. I have been stranded before, so I carry a lot of things in my car for me and my family for if we get stranded or if we want to spend the night somewhere or just for an emergency or just basically any kind of survival that you, <laughs> that you can possibly think of. I like to have it with me. Uh, I would rather uh, have it and not need it than need it and not have it. So um, like I said, you don't have to be this extreme uh, you do not have to carry all this with you. You can customize it to fit whatever your needs are and your family's needs. So, uh, we'll go ahead and get into this uh, bag here. It's a really cute little pink sparkly donut bag. And you can see here it's got a little pink handle. And it's got a beautiful pink sparkly donut on the front with all these gorgeous sprinkles. I love, love, love all the sweet little sprinkles. And um, this is actually a lunchbox. <laughs> and I'll open it up here so you can see it's lined with the, you know, like the thick uh, kind of cooler uh, material to keep everything cold. But um, this is a lunchbox. I got it at Walmart a couple of years ago. And as you can see, it's packed full of pink little necessities. <laughs> or at least I think they're necessities because. I usually use the majority of these things at some point in time. So uh, we'll go ahead and get into all of the things I carry in my EDC bag. And like I said, you can customize this to fit your needs. You can minimize it, maximize it, you know, however um, you want to do yours. So I'm going to go ahead and just start pulling things out here and showing you what I carry in mine. I have this little pink heart felt little decor piece and this is just to make it cutesy <laughs> I just like to have it laying on top here so when I open it I can see it I just think it's really pretty and girly so that's just for decor <laughs> um, we'll start over here on the left I have this little pink flat flashlight and I got this at Dollar Tree I'm gonna turn it on here so just warning you there'll be a flashing light so, of course, you know, everyone should carry a flashlight in their car. I mean, in case you get a flat tire or you have to walk somewhere or you're trying to look for something uh, or, you know, if you're out in the dark, whatever, um, you should always have a flashlight. So, and I always like to carry more than one flashlight with me in case one doesn't work or in case you have someone with you. Um, I'm going to turn it on here. So, you know, each one of you can have one if you're, you know, car breaks down or if you get a flat tire or if you get separated it's just easier to find each other if you've got flashing lights so I like to carry more than one and then I've got my bubblegum pink paracord bracelet or survival bracelet uh, as some people call it and um, this has many many uses uh, paracord is like the strongest rope uh, it can hold up to like 550 pounds you can use it for fishing, building shelter, first aid. There's just a wide variety of different things you can use that for. Um, and then I've got this little uh, kind of emergency kit. And I'll show you what's on the inside of it. I have this little tool. 
and it has a little bottle opener, a nail file, and a little razor blade, like a little knife. And it all just kind of folds down like a Swiss Army knife um, into this nice little compact tool. And I got this at Dollar Tree. And then I have a little Ziploc bag with little pink uh, Q-tips. And these can be used for first aid or, you know, just really kind of anything that you would need them for. And then I got a little pair of tweezers. And then I have a couple of band-aids. And I have a separate first aid kit in my car. So, you know, this is not all the, <laughs> the first aid um, items that I have. I have a whole separate uh, first aid kit in my car that I will do a separate video on. <laughs> so this is just a few little things that I have here in my EDC. <laughs> and I keep them all in this little plastic container here. And then I have this pink wine tool. And um, we don't drink, but you know, this could be used for uh, a number of things. I'll open it up here. It's got a little knife, like a little jigsaw knife. And then um, it's got a bottle opener. And then this, the screw part here, you could use that for a tool or just, you know, an emergency. It would probably come in handy to do something with. So. Uh, of course, I mean, you could use it for a bottle of wine, but like I said, we don't drink, so, uh, but I do keep it in here just for the uh, use of it uh, as like an emergency little tool, especially with the little knife part on the end. And then I have this little pink uh, hourglass, and I have this in here, you know, like in case your cell phone goes dead, you don't have a way to time something, uh, you you know, you might need a timer for something you never know, especially in first aid. So, um, and then I have this pink antibacterial hand sanitizer spray, and this is, uh, just pretty much pure rubbing alcohol. So you could use this for first aid as well as sanitizing your hands. And then I have some scotch tape because you just never know when you'll need that. Not necessarily for emergencies, but just day to day use. And this is a little uh, X-Acto knife, and um, it looks kind of cream on camera, but it's actually a really pale baby pink. And there's the little razor knife, just very small and compact, so that comes in handy a lot. <laughs> and then this is a little flashlight that you can clip like on to your hat. And I'm gonna turn it on here. So the light comes out the top, so that way if you wanted to be hands-free, if you didn't want to carry a flashlight you know, in your hand and you had a hat on, you can clip this on your hat and it'll kind of light your path. And it's pink, so of course, <laughs> I thought it was pretty cute to have. <laughs> or like if you're in your car and you don't want to hold a light, you could clip that like on your visor, you know, your little sun visor. And then I got this really cool little whistle at Walmart, and it has a whistle. And then on the back side, it has a thermometer, and it reads in both Celsius and Fahrenheit. And that's really cool to have if you're out somewhere, if you're stranded or hiking or anything. And then on the other side, it has a compass. So that way, if you get lost, you can find your way. And of course, the whistle for emergencies or to, you know, blow if you're lost so somebody can find you so I thought that was really neat and then I got this little Vaseline lip therapy and it's um, I like it because it's pink but you can put a wick in this and light it and use it as a candle it will burn like a candle so there's a little survival tip for you <laughs> uh, and then I keep um, these little zip ties these are like the medium size zip ties because they come in super duper handy. And then I've got some little earplugs in cotton candy pink and this cute little case. And then I have a pink stapler. That's very handy to have with you. Not necessarily, I mean, you could use it for emergencies, but like I said, that's more for like an everyday use. 
uh, pink ink pen. You never know when you have to write down something um, in an emergency or just everyday use. And then I have some uh, dental floss and this really cute little teeny tiny pink container. <laughs> it's a real small, compact. And then I have a um, little pink glue stick. And then, of course, I have to have something sweet themed in my bag. So I have this really cute little pink lollipop. And it has a little princess star wand on it. And um, not only is it cute to keep in your bag and very girly, but it's also very practical because if you have someone with you that's diabetic or, you know, if someone's sugar drops, um, then you can let them have this and it'll bring their sugar levels back up. Or if you have a little kid that has a boo-boo and they're crying and you have to bandage them up or whatever, then you can give them this to kind of calm them down. And then I have some little teeny tiny uh, zip ties. And I have them here in this zip, uh, Ziploc bag. And then I have this little magnifying glass that lights up. I've hauled these several times on my channel. I have them everywhere because I like to use these if I don't have my reader glasses. Uh, so that would come in handy. And plus, like I said, it does light up. And then I have this really cute little pink lighter. You should always have a lighter with you in case of emergency, you know, in case you need to light a candle or make a fire. And I also have not one, but two <laughs> pink lighters. This is the backup. I've got both of these at Dollar Tree because you never know when one will run out of lighter fluid. So I always keep two. And just in case, uh, in case both of them runs out <laughs> of lighter fluid, I keep waterproof matches. <laughs> so that way, even if it's raining, you can build a fire if you need to. So, you know, triple. <laughs> I'm triple ready. <laughs> oh, goodness. And then this little case I got at Dollar Tree, it's actually for contacts, but I've turned it into a little pill case. And it's really convenient because it's got two little compartments. In one I have ibuprofen, and then the other I have Tylenol, and the little pink pill is a Benadryl because my honey's allergic to bees. And this little pill right here is a motion sickness pill because I do tend to have a lot of motion sickness in a car if I'm not driving. So, uh, And look, the little container matches my little pink lighter. <laughs> It's got the same little pink leopard print. And then I have this little pink uh, hole punch. And what I think is so cute about this hole punch, instead of punching a circle, it, um, it punches a heart. <laughs> a little heart shape. Isn't that cute? I love it. <laughs> and then um, I have another X-Acto knife. I showed you the little one earlier. But this one is a little bit uh, better quality. It's longer. And uh, so I just keep both of them in there. And then let's see here. I've got a pair of pink scissors. I mean, that's kind of self-explanatory. I think you always need scissors in your car. And I also have um, a drift stain stick those work really well you know in case you spill something on you you can get it out and then i have this little correction tape i love the bubblegum pink color of it and let's see here i'll get this back here i have a little sewing kit i'll open it up and show you everything that's in it I think I got this at Dollar Tree, I think. But look at these little teeny tiny little sewing scissors. And they're pink. <laughs> and then there's a little box that has some um, safety pins and buttons and a few sewing needles. And it is also bubblegum pink. And then I have this little container that has different size uh, sewing needles. It's pink as well. And then I have the teeny tiniest little spools of thread <laughs> in all different colors in case you need to sew a button on or 
sew up something, you know, in a shirt, pants or something. And then I'll have a little measuring tape and a pink little thimble. So here's my little pink sewing kit. <laughs> and I think this is actually maybe two sewing kits combined that I got at Dollar Tree. I think I had to buy two to get everything that I wanted in pink. <laughs> And then I have this little tool kit, and it's like a little miniature um, tool kit. It has teeny tiny little screwdrivers and a magnifying glass. And as you can see, one of the screwdrivers over here is pink. But this comes in really handy, especially for if you're working on like sunglasses or eyeglasses, the little screws, you know, or if um, you need to open something to replace the batteries and it has one of those little teeny tiny screws, this comes in really handy, so little teeny tiny tool kit and then this little container has uh, Tums in case somebody's sick or nauseated you know or has a belly ache and of course they're all pink <laughs> I picked out all the pink ones <laughs> this little container is perfect uh, to hold Tums and then I have another one of these little plastic containers and in it I have um, these little miniature teeny tiny little things of super glue I think there's three of them in there and then the little red things you know are the lids the little tips but you can always use super glue especially if you wear fake nails <laughs> and then I have this plastic spoon and fork I got this at uh, I think Dollar Tree Dollar Tree or Walmart but you can it always comes in handy to have then I have this little mirror and you can use it for you know if you need to put your makeup on or you know if you need to reflect uh, you know to let somebody know that you're stranded somewhere you know reflect the light off of it um, then I have some staples to refill my stapler because it's no good to have a stapler if you don't have the staples <laughs> so I have a box of refills and then I have this little bag of uh, safety pins because these are super duper handy just for everyday use and then I have these little they're kind of like miniature toothbrushes um, or they're almost like the little placker you know little floss things as you can see there's little teeny tiny brushes on the end <laughs> so you know if you are stuck somewhere then you could use this to you know take care of your teeth and you know, for the time being until you can use your actual toothbrush and then this little bag this little twin star uh, ziploc bag it's just a teeny tiny one <laughs> and it's full of different paper clips there's all kinds of them there's um, flamingo ones and cupcake ones and I see Hello Kitty's uh, <laughs> bow <laughs> right there so uh, just have a variety of different paper clips and then I have a pink calculator. And then I have this little tool. And it came in this little plastic, um, protective little plastic case. And I just put the pink washi tape around it to make it pink. <laughs> but this little tool has all kinds of things. It's got a little saw, <laughs> a little um, razor blade, and it has uh, a little uh, bottle opener and there's all kinds of little things here in the middle that do different things so this has got a little ruler on it this is a handy dandy little tool but that razor blade is super duper sharp and so is this little saw over here so that's why uh, it comes in this little plastic case so to protect you know from getting cut or hurt and then I have this little pink plastic container with two little stickers on the front and in here I just have some pink binder clips and I love these little containers I got them at Dollar Tree and then I have another one back here I love how the sides snap shut I just really like these little containers. I use them for a lot of different things. 
And in here, I have these little pink clips. And I got these at Dollar Tree in the craft section. I just thought they would come in handy for something. I don't know what, but <laughs> you never know. I'm sure at some point in time, I'll find a use for them. And then a couple of years ago, when we had the solar eclipse, I bought these glasses online to, you know, be able to watch the eclipse. And they were kind of hard to find, so I didn't throw them away. I just thought they might come in handy for an emergency. You just never know <laughs> uh, with the sun and everything. So I just throw them in here just in case. And then I have this little cotton candy pink little um, measuring tape. And... Um, just pull it out here you see it's a teeny tiny one <laughs> and then you just push the button in the middle and and it retracts it back in that cute and then the last thing that I have in here is this little tool I keep it in this little ziploc bag just for safety and this is what it looks like when it's open it has a little pair of little pliers um, and then it also has these little, um, little knives on the sides, little like razor blades and little, um, nail files and a little itty bitty knife. And that's what it looks like with everything out. And then it folds back up into this nice, neat little compact tool and it has little clip on it there if you need to clip it onto something and that's everything that I carry in my EDC bag I'll give you a little overview here of everything and like I said um, this may be a little extreme for you but you can definitely minimize it to fit your needs and uh, this may not be enough for you you may want to add a bunch of things um, for your EDC bag. So I just wanted to give you some ideas and show you what I carry in mine. So I hope this did give you some ideas of things that you want to keep with you in case of an emergency. Or um, like I said, it doesn't have to be like just for survival, just for an emergency. <laughs> you know, if you just need some tape or a stapler or, um, you know, a safety pin or a sewing kit um, things just come up throughout the day and you or your family or friends somebody may need uh, your help or need a little something so I always like to carry all these different little things with me just to be prepared and like I said um, as I show you the things that I have in the truck of my car it may blow your mind that I carry this much stuff <laughs> with me all the time but um, like I said before, I would rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. I have been stranded before and it was really terrifying and I really learned my lesson because I didn't have everything with me that I needed. So uh, ever since then, I just like to travel um, being prepared uh, for me and my family. If we are going to be out and about or if we're going to be traveling whatever it may be, I like to have all these things with me because it does just make me feel comfortable and it just makes me feel prepared and, you know, just kind of peace of mind. So here is what everything looks like packed back in to my little pink sparkly donut EDC bag, uh, all pink edition. It just fits perfectly. And as I add to this, you know, I can always get a bigger bag or a bag with compartments in it or something but for right now this serves the purpose and I really like this bag it's super cute super girly and very me <laughs> here's my little pink heart to add back on top for decor and it just shuts and zips up very nicely to store all my little necessities <laughs> And that is everything in my EDC bag, all packed up in a nice pink sparkly package <laughs> with sprinkles on top. <laughs> so that's everything for this video. So until next time, stay sweet, stay pink, take care, and God bless. And remember, don't let anyone ever 
crystal, your sparkle. Bye for now.